welcome to my channel this is captain binoy varagil assistant professor department of english st joseph college dev greek old court kerala we discussed the poetics of aristotle we looked at uh, the chapters and uh, we know the gist of each and every chapter of the poetics the poetics has a lot of significance and uh, we come across a lot of new terms and terminologies in the poetics in this lecture we are looking at some of the important terms in the text the poetics let us just uh, uh, define each of the terms first we have catharsis catharsis is a key element of tragedy which induces pity and fear in the audience pity of the hero's plight and fear that it will befall us next term is character character is one of the six components of tragedy that refers not to the attributes of a given person but the person himself as a representative entity in the play the third term is comedy comedy presents human beings as worse than they are in real life in order to present a different type of imitation than in a classical tragedy next term is complex plot a complex plot involves a unity of action and purpose and ultimately leads to a climactic reversal and recognition the next term is complication complication is the rising action of a dramatic work that extends from the beginning of the play to the climax or reversal the next term is denouement denouement is the unraveling of the plot that takes place after the climax next we have diction diction is one of the six components of tragedy it includes how an actor delivers the lines written for him the eighth term is drama drama presents actions before an audience with the use of actors rather than oral recitation by a single narrator the next term is epic epic presents action through narrative and is usually recited orally by a single narrator the tenth topic is hexameter hexameter is the epic meter or a line of 6 feet next we have the iambic 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 is the dramatic meter with a syncopated beat more closely related to the way we speak in normal life the next term is mimesis or imitation Imitation is the defining purpose of all artists to represent life as it is as we think it is or as it should be. The next term is narrative. Narrative is the dramatization of action by a single narrator. The next top term is pity. Pity is one of the key elements of catharsis driven by our empathy for the hero's plight the next term is plot plot is one of the six components of tragedy but the most important aristotle calls plot the soul of tragedy since it is the arrangements of incidents that justifies all the other elements of tragedy in its dramatization of action the next term is poetry poetry is any form of art 
which seeks to imitate life through words or the rhythm of words. Next concept is simple plot. A simple plot is a plot that doesn't necessarily maintain unity, reversal or recognition. It can be episodic. The next term is song. A song is one form of conveying action in a tragedy. Spectacle. Spectacle is one of the six components of tragedy. It includes anything that is presented before the audience on stage. Aristotle notes this is the least significant aspect of tragedy since it is not vital to the actual text which can be read alone. Next term is thought. Thought is speech by characters used to explain, justify or substitute for physical action. Next term is tragedy. Tragedy is an imitation of action that is serious, complete, of significant magnitude depicted with rhythmic language and or song in the form of action, not narrative, that produces a purgation of pity and fear in the audience. The next term is unity. Unity is the revolution of a work around a central axis, theme or purpose. All components of the work must work towards this central purpose. These are some of the important terms we have to be familiar with when we learn Aristotle or Aristotle's The Poetics. So each of the students must know what these terms are, know their definition. Please learn it. It will help you in future. Thank you very much for listening. May God bless you.